Let's talk about the Accra Kidi Mile races uh, that will be happening in Accra pretty soon. And the organizer of the event is here in the studio with me, Mrs. Catherine Morton. Catherine, you're welcome. Thank you, Yao. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm, good. I'm good. Tell us a bit about the uh, Accra Kidima races. Okay, so um, this is our fourth year for the Accra Kidima races. Yeah. It's an event that brings together children between the ages of 3 to 15. And what we are doing is we are doing a marathon. So okay. it's essentially a marathon for children. Mm -hmm. And the idea is to inculcate in our children the habits of living a healthy lifestyle, but as well trying to nurture talents at this, I mean, at the very early stage, because we know that with sports, um, this is the best time to, you know, bring out talent. So basically, that's what Kitty Maori is about. So, so, so three year olds to 15 year olds. Yes. How many, how many children are you expecting? Um, in, so, in yeah, so we are expecting between 3,000 to 4,000 children and we have six different categories so right. the children are running um the longest distance we have is two miles okay and so the the distances are appropriate for their ages okay. and we we are looking to see three-year-olds going and, and endurance and going around one football field okay. and you know it sounds very easy but for children this is something that is you know something that takes a lot of energy and time mm -hmm. and so it's an exciting day for children but also for parents as well okay. uh, because we see the parents coming along and sharing their children whilst they're you know doing something for themselves hence we have the slogan that says be your own hero okay yeah now four thousand or 3,000 kids. That's, that's, that's a lot of children in one place. I yes. mean, irrespective of the fact that your parents are going to be there, what's, what sort of you know, precautionary measures, safety measures that you have put in place to make sure everybody's fine? Yes, yeah, so um, essentially it's a marathon. So everything that you would expect to see at a proper marathon, you'd see the same thing. So in okay. terms of like having security from the police, mm -hmm. um, having um, uh, medical services like ambulances mm -hmm. and medical personnel on standby, mm -hmm. having the volunteers who will be on the streets, blocking right. of the roads and all that. So exactly the same thing that we have for marathons. We have the same thing um, and we are doing it at the Elbak Sports Stadium right. and we know that uh, people are talking about the coronavirus and I mean, thankfully we don't have it here mm -hmm. but we are also doing um, a few things on the day to make sure that everybody who comes to the event is safe. Okay. So it's a 100% safe events okay. um, for families and parents to bring their children and we we rarely have any casualties on the day. Okay, so, yeah. so take us to the, the age categories and the races that they are going to be doing. Okay, so... So, so you mentioned the three-year-olds are going around the, the football field. One, which is 400 meters. With 400 meters? Yes. Okay, so 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 then let's let's move up. Okay, so we have the three to four years, okay. um, which is the 400 meters. We have five to six. Mm -hmm. um, they will do, um, um, I think, 800 meters. Okay. Seven to eight years. Um, nine to 10, and then we have under 12. Under 12 does 1.5 miles. Okay. And then under um, okay. under 15, 15, yes, under 15 does um, two miles, two which miles. is the longest distance. Okay. Yes, but on, on the day as well, um, the races take probably like an hour and an hour and a half to complete. Okay. Uh, we have other sporting disciplines mm -hmm. and uh, because it's a whole day's event. So we have basketball, we mm -hmm. have football, uh, we have badminton, mm -hmm. we have table tennis competitions between um, schools. Okay. And we are happy that this year we're going to have the Ghana Olympic Committee, Tokyo team, right. um, coming to, to, to visit mm -hmm. and be our special guest uh, because I think that uh, they also believe and understand that this is where we nurture the talents. Right. So we are happy to have them on board to support us for the Ghana Kidima races. Now, I mean, when, when is the Ghana Kidima, uh, the Accra Kidima races? races, yes. So, yeah. Um, so is this Saturday? This Saturday? Yes, okay. this Saturday at the Elwax Sports Stadium. We start at 7 in the morning and it's just a, a fantastic day. We urge all parents um, to come on board and bring the, um, their kids. And okay. um, if you haven't registered yet, you can come on the day and register at the gate. Okay. Catherine, uh, thank you very much. Uh, is there a final message you want to put out? Um, so we'd just like to thank all our sponsors who have been with uh, us. You can't mention your sponsors. Yes, <laughs> we won't. But we'd like to thank all of them for supporting us and the schools that we work with. We work, okay. we work with over 80 schools and right. we are just grateful that everybody has embraced this event. Catherine, thank you very much. Thank you for having me. So the Accra Kidima races is uh, on uh, Saturday at the Elwak Sports Stadium. Big, big events for children. I mean, you might want to take your children there and then have some fun. Uh, football, athletics, there's badminton, there's table tennis, there's basketball. A whole lot of events there at the Elwak Sports Stadium. That's